Hello everyone, it's Lado. I'm in the basement and I'm here to tell you about a competition that we are running from now until the 1st of December. So if you're in the UK and you buy any piece of clothing from the shop, you'll be entered into a chance to win this t-shirt. There's only one of them, only one person's going to win. However, it will also be personally delivered by Alex and maybe me. But not only that, you'll also win the opportunity to be in the live Survive the Hunt with Alex. And so you'll be running against all the hunters uh, in the Christmas uh, live stream for Survive the Hunt. So yeah, that will be the chance to win and good luck. Hello and welcome to the show. We are here today on GTA 5 for another round of Survive the Hunt. Yes, it is that time. The goal is simple. I will be trying to survive for 24 hours of game time while this lot are going to try and give chase and they've managed to murder each other immediately. Well done. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> that's, that's the goal. Uh, there is a blimp, a very, very brightly coloured blimp behind us. Uh, we are going to set up, we set up a quarter past 11. I have some pre's to be exploding, uh, dotted around the map. There are a bunch of pre's. I know where the pre's are located. There will hopefully be a map in the description of the video as well, if you want to have a look yourself and play along. Um, I've got to try and blow up as many of those as I can. At the end of the 24 hours though, I don't win if I am just alive. I have also got to try and get out of the city. So, we have got to explode as many pre's as possible and then flee the city um, to win. So we can do that by train, tough to time it but possible we can do it by aircraft helicopter or plane or we can do it via boat uh there are some in the marina there are some along the beach i don't think there's anywhere else in the city you can get one there might be some of the uh what are they called i've forgotten the name of them oh, they spawn in for the business battles around the coast although i don't think i'd ever even if they happen to spawn i don't really know where they are well enough to actually get there uh, like the dinghies, that's what I think, I think they kind of like the dinghies, you know, if you're really lucky. I guess you could steal a police boat, but that's going to take some effort, uh, so it is unlikely. Um, yeah, well, there's nothing fun spawning at the moment, really. That's why I'm kind of heading, it's really fugitive or, or blister. That's kind of my options here, unless we find anything fun up this part really isn't any... I mean, I feel like I say this every time. Oh! Oh, that, okay, no. That, take it back. That was your lane. It was a quick... Uh, there's a Feltzer, but if I go... So, Feltzer will break the, the supercar rule we have. Basically, the faster. The faster cars like the Feltzer. I mean, I don't know, that's not technically a supercar. But if I go in, in in them, then the hunters are allowed to use them as well, which, while tempting, uh, it's tempting for me because they're quick. The hunters then get access to them, which just makes my life harder. I will go in them as a desperate measures. However... I tend to avoid them unless I have to. Uh, this is a really bad sport. Well, like, again, yeah, I, I swear they were supposed to be like felons and jackals and maybe an oracle, but I swear there should be more. There's not even like any. I mean, it's a beautiful world where there are no. Well, it's the FQ2. There's no real SUVs. There's none of the powerful SUVs, though. Uh, Coquette and Banshees about the place. Yeah, because now you found about. Aha! That is what we want. I'm going to get a beautiful shout. I will take your car. Thank you very much. We are not breaking the supercar rule. The Zion, I mean, oh, is a simian car. I, I thought I checked. And I thought this one was safe. Problem is, if it's a simian car, there might not be many spawning. I didn't even, I don't think the Zion was a simian car. I knew the Banshee was. Lester! I, 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 I thought the Banshee and I, I thought the Felon was. Felon's Zion are spawning at least. Right. Oh, hey. This car I might not use very long. Okay. Oop, it's a stolen car, so let's abandon ship there. Right. Simeon wants this car. We know that. The hunters are going to have been released. They're, they're on their way. Now, they won't get to this part of the map immediately. What have we got in terms of pre-locations? Uh, okay, there's a bunch. Actually, there is one over here. Uh, is actually, we were right next to one. I could probably blow it up quite quick. I could... Okay. Could be quite a sneaky one. Have we got the window down? I mean, I, the window down is... Oh, Lester. Oh, I need you to get here quite quickly. Yeah, it just happened to have ended up by... Oh, no, more cars are spawning. There's a Vigoro oh, and a Rancher doing? or whatever it help? is. Okay, so one set's kind of sorted itself out. So around this corner, there should be a pre somewhere. It's either down the pedestrian bit or... Could be in the little... No, it actually looks a little bit closer than normal. I'm not quite sure where it is, but there is a pre here. If we can blow this one up, 
uh, quickly before the hunter... So we can maybe blow this one up. So I'm not allowed to blow it up in the initial... Oh, it's right there. That's an awkward place. Um, okay, so sticky bomb that. I want to get out of here quite quickly because I don't think the hunters are going to be ready for this one to be detonated. Uh, okay, so we've got rid of that one. We can get on the motorway and leave the area. Uh, that is my goal. If we can just get out of here... Uh, oh, have I missed the turning? Oh, I mean, it's okay. We can head this direction. Uh, they are unlikely... Oh, they have got here, but... A little... They, they got close. I didn't have as much time as I thought I did. I figured, because I was the other side of the city, they were going to take a little bit of time to catch up to us. I've just realised I've not changed. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's a disaster. It's night time, so I'm going to be more difficult to spot. This is bad. Wait, wait, no one's going. I'm just going to do this. Uh, I'm hoping no one was watching. That was a terrible turn as well. Uh, yeah, I am not changed. I am still ballistic mask wearing a suit. Now, I can't change from inside the car. Oh, crap. How do I change clothes without looking suspicious? If I get out of this car, the blimp might see me. That's the concern here. Oh, this is super dangerous. Now, then, unlikely to notice my character, because we're kind of blacked out in here. It's so... It, it's slightly frustrating that you can't change clothes while in a car. Um, is there a bush we can hide? <laughs> the patented fail race way. Hide in a bush. Uh, right. I know the second I get out of the car... See, that if I'd pressed Y then to get out of the car, we would have been shot. Or we would have been made. We could have, we would have killed them before they killed us. But we would have been made. I do not... Like, the, at what point do we get out of the car? The longer we sit here, the more dangerous it is. We get out of a car, it's dangerous. Neither are fun. Yeah, the, I'm hoping the angle and the black mask makes it difficult to see me for anyone coming past. Uh, maybe if I crouch in front of the car, I'll be okay. It's definitely. I, you see, I saw the lights on the um, ballista there, and it freaked me out because I thought they were lights of a better car. Um, like I said, a better car, like a, a custom car, but it doesn't seem to be the case. All right, that was a little bit higgledy piggledy. I'm going to use the proper English term. <laughs> uh, right. I'll take it. Yeah, not quite what I wanted to do. Not, I didn't re- oh well. I mean, it was what I wanted to do. It was well executed. I just, I was a little carried away and slightly forgot myself. Uh, so that's never good. Now, there is a car by the pier somewhere. Now, I'm not sure whether it's on top of the pier, whether it's under the pier. Now, it's a gamble going for it. So, logically speaking, I would go for this one by the pier. Or I'd go for the one by the um, uh, shopping centre. Logically speaking, you would. They're closest. However, the hunters know that. And they often head towards, or they often think that I'm going to plan that. So I normally don't. We're doing, like, we're going to try to go for the double bluff, the reverse psychology. I don't think they're expecting me to do this. Because while it makes logical sense, I tend to avoid it because it makes logical sense. Oh, I didn't turn my headlights on. Ooh, that was brave. Slash foolish. Uh, so, yeah, we're going for the... Logical, illogical. Y you, you get what I mean, right? Um, right. Please don't despawn, car. We are going to park in a handicap bay. I do apologise. However, uh, yeah. Now, where is this car? Is the question. Also, was that a hunter that just turned into the car park? Nope, it's an R8. That's fine. So there is definitely a car somewhere around here. Is it above us, though? So I know there's, there's a dot here. It is on this side of the pier. I don't think they would have put it on the beach. Although there's nothing saying they can't... They, you know, they, they can put it on the beach if they so wish. No rules against it. Um, it definitely doesn't... I mean, we go for the quad bike escape. Quad bike was surprisingly effective last time. Um... Where is it? Uh, aha! Right, okay, so it is in 
in the pier. Hmm. That's actually quite awkward to get. I don't know, I have a plan. I have a plan. I See, I'm contemplating going for the jet ski escape, but they are going to probably expect the jet ski escape. Or I could go for a just mill around at the far end approach. Hope they think I'm an NPC. Is there a way to get my character to look at their phone? I don't think there is. But yeah, okay. So, we have got all the time. So I'm not going to drive out of here because there's only really one way in and out. Um, oh, I did not do... Pops turn over. I don't think it's going to be ready, actually. We'll, do, we'll explode it, and then we'll call Lester. It's dark, so they're going to struggle to see me. Uh, right. We will detonate that. Okay, so we are going to run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. And if we can get to this far end of the pier before they get here, I'm hoping... Okay, and then what we got to do is go, right, Lester, because I suspect Cops Turn a Blind Eye won't be on yet. Um... Won't be ready, hey, so remove one wanted level. Okay, so you're in okay oh, wrong button. And right. Okay, okay. And then we're going to just saunter along. It's a little bit sneaky. It's a little bit sneaky, but I don't expect them. So they're not going to think that I'm going to hang around. They're going to expect me to go on a jet ski. They're going to expect me to try and bolt or go on the quad bike. Right? There's that's what they're that's that's their thinking. That would make logical sense. Again, it's all a game of can I double and triple bluff my way out of it. I don't know if there's any vehicles up here, like bikes or anything. The fact that nothing's here yet concerns me. It means I should have just got on a jet ski. Um, but yeah, the, the AI are just kind of sauntering around on their own. Now, there are some dangers of me being on foot, which is why you often don't see it. Uh, mainly, well, some of the big dangers are my walking animation as a player are slightly different to the AIs. Now, you'd have to be looking quite hard to see it, but if they are suspicious, they might notice. Uh, other differences are I will, well, the AI will only go certain places. They will have idle animations that I don't. Uh, you know, there's only so much that I can do with all of that. Um, you know, I can do my best, but, you know, there are limitations, really. Uh, we're just kind of having a wander, having a chill time. Uh, if someone turns up... I mean, on foot, one of the advantages I do get from on foot is a they won't know what the walking patterns are around here because they never really come out this way you don't normally find yourself out here and b i can whip out a gun quite quickly and shoot them in theory i don't want to actually pull out a gun unless i have to uh, because i don't want to freak out the ais that are about are there any boats over this part this is my thought um <laughs> danger man's ending task no i'll blow it up too i'm happy at the moment uh now we can go back towards the dock there. I don't know where, I mean, the AI probably hang out, they probably wouldn't know, so I can't, well, if I run, I will get spotted, but I can't, but there's no one out here this far. I was going to see if they are covering the jet skis. Uh, so, yeah, they're going to have assumed I've left, right? Because you wouldn't hang around this long. I mean, if I could pop, uh, the problem is if I popped one, it'd be awesome. However... Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything. The blimp's wandered off over there. Where is the next? Where is another one I can go? There's nothing really down over here. No, there's nothing. There's miles away. We keep, I mean, honestly, uh, I might be best off going for... Oh, shame there's no boats there. That would be awesome if there had been. Or jet skis or anything. Can we get... Oh, God damn it. Ladder. There we go. Yeah, real shame. That would have been so perfect. Are there any boats down this part? Doesn't look like it. Okay, I mean, I can't see them out with boats. I think. I think they took so long to get there. Obviously, they were the other side of the map. They took longer to get there. I think they've just assumed I've left and they've missed it because they were quite slow. Like, the blimp got over there quite late. If I'd driven away, there's no chance they would have been able to do anything about it. Uh, they would never have seen me. So, yeah, okay. That's fine. Now, yeah, jet ski, the only way... Uh, no, we can go... We can go through the... Uh, it's a bit risky going through the canals. So I can shortcut my way. No, actually, no. I don't have to go all the way through the canal. Well, I, I... I know where I'm going. I can go through one of the storm drainy bits, and then that will dump me out right next to... Uh, the pre... That's the exit of the docks. Now, unfortunately, it does mean I'm without a car. However... 
that's fine. Well, it's not fine, but it'll it'll work. They could blimp could cover that area. Is it likely to be looking? I mean, yeah, so the downside of the jet ski, of course, is you're bleeding obvious when you're not supposed to be somewhere. Difficult to track, but very obvious it's not supposed to be there. Um, do I have armor on? I don't remember. I don't... Did I put armor on before we started? Uh, don't remember, but I'll put a couple of heavy armors on and that should fill the bar up. Uh, now, I don't... I mean, uh, the safe, okay, the safe route we go around the back of the airport. I don't want to spend all that time going around the back of the airport. So, shame it's not night time, because visibility would be a lot worse for them if it was. Uh, I'm hoping the blimp's going to be a different part of the map. It's a little, as I said, it's a little gamble here. We're going for a mix of vehicles, honestly. I don't mind it. You know, we're, we like a variety here. Now all I need is an air... Oh, we might have an aircraft as an escape vessel at the end of the day. And then we need a train. Can we ride a train? Maybe we use a train as a getaway vehicle and then a helicopter? Uh, <laughs> I don't know we can do all of that, but... Yeah. So this is a way we can kind of travel incognito while also travelling very obviously. The blimp's over that side. Eee, okay, well that's fine. It's actually heading the wrong way. So yeah, we're, we're both, we're kind of off the road. Cars are unlikely to spot us. However, the aircraft will. And the cars can spot us. A, they do sometimes take shortcuts down here. Or they might just make a mistake and fall off a road and fall in, you know, into this area. It would be very unhelpful if they did, but it is possible. Um, I did think this was faster than it is, but never mind. Uh, how... Oh yeah, where can we get out of the water by the Simeon docks is a good question. I don't know, because I don't normally take that route. It's not normally a thing that I think about, or that we've had to deal with. However, we are heading back that way. The blimp is nowhere to be seen. Oh, I was busy looking around. Uh, now, uh, this is the Merryweather Dock, which, no, it's not quite the Merryweather Dock, it's around somewhere. Uh, now, ra around somewhere over here is where I could do with getting out. There's a ladder right there. Fantastic. Okay, jet ski got us across town. And swim. Yeah, jet ski got us across town relatively efficiently. Uh, please water be hard. Okay, there we go. Climb. Oh. Okay, water up. Cl Dude. Dude, ladder. Oh, no, for God's sake. Am I really just going to have to sit here bobbing in the water waiting for you to grab hold? There we go. <laughs> yes, the answer was yes, I was. Thankfully, I didn't have to wait too long. Okay. Well, this bit doesn't look too bad. We should be right next to... I mean, I guess we could get we'll go back down there and get on the jet ski again. Um... Ah, there is a little downside. I think we're going to have to use a fugitive here as a getaway car. Um, right. Okay, plan. Whoop. Uh, we are going to go Leicester. So, I'm going to do a cop turn a blind eye, immediately hey, bomb the car, and try get away. So, this is going to be my best shot at this. No, 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 no. Mine. Ugh. That was very lucky. Okay, so... Oh, well, never mind. Uh, I got the wrong one. Uh, yoink. Okay. And away we go. Goodbye. Pre number three. I'll take it. Right, so that one there's exploded. We got it. So I'm the reason I'm booting it a little bit is I want to get up here onto this busy road. Actually, to be honest, I want a different car. Smash window on this. Smash windows nowadays are just too much of a giveaway. Um, they're too good at spotting them. I don't know whether I can clear it. Sometimes you can cheese it a little bit uh, once it's been broken. Try and get them to roll the window down. Did not work. Uh, I mean, the blimp's on its way. Oh, there is one, actually. There's one up by Lester's house. Crap. I don't actually want there to be one up by Lester's house. Because I'm going to look suspicious going this way. I mean, actually, I could even... I could... Go for it. Ah, crap. Did that see me? Maybe not. 
I mean, it's freaked out an AI. It's done some donuts in the intersection and then had an accident over there. What is it doing? What the fuck? Shit, yo. It's definitely suspicious of stuff. <laughs> I don't know what stuff it's suspicious of. <laughs> Why it's suspicious of the stuff that it was, but it was. Um, yeah, okay. I mean, this isn't the worst thing in the world to... Worst place in the world to find myself? This is bad, though. A lot of cars coming towards us. All it takes is one to notice the window. Now, the damage doesn't always sink. That's kind of what I'm relying on. Hold on, what is that car doing? No, it's searching stuff at the junction again. I've got 44 seconds. The problem is if I blow that car up... Uh, if I blow that car up, they, I'm really going to be swarmed. Do I reckon this car is strong enough? I don't, know what, I don't know exactly where it is. That's the problem. I reckon this car is good enough to get away. I don't reckon it is. So what I'm going to do is... Oh, I don't think that was very good. Okay, let's just go up this road just for safety's sake. Just in case it decides to turn around and come and investigate and say hello. Didn't. It didn't. We're okay. Yeah, my window's a problem now. My window's a problem. I want to swap cars, but I don't... There's no point in me getting an FQ2. I might be incognito, but... Oh, no, 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 no. Don't... Oh, that's really bad timing. I can't go and do the same loop again. Oh, no. Don't lie. Oh, what can I do here? So they are probably rightfully thinking that this is the sort of route I'm likely to be taking away from here. Oh, no. They've got a roadblock going on here. I don't know what I can do here other than shoot the car. That was lucky. I mean, they've searched this one. And there's enough cars sneaking past. You must get mad that am I likely to be made here? I mean, I don't know whether I've been made. This is the problem bit. Nope, they're going back. They're continuing the roadblock. I should have probably beeped at that one, to be honest. That was so lucky. Holy crap. That was so lucky. Although it has now just come barreling along after us. So I'm guessing maybe the window damage hasn't synced. Uh, I can't go to the... I want to go to the one in Mirror Park. There is one in Mirror Park, right? Yeah, there is. I want to go blow it up, but... We've got three white fugitives. Well, this is... We've got some good cover going on here. See, I'm trying not to do... I'm trying not to do the typical thing of, like, freak out early. So they were getting out of their car to maybe investigate harder. Uh, the three white fugitives... The problem we've got is we've all stayed together, and it's funny. It is all natural, but... Oh, uh, yeah, this is a problem bit for me now. What do you do? Okay, we are in, we are in loads of trouble here. There's so many cars now hanging around. Um, I could just get out and shoot before more come and join in. See, I'm trying to act like a weird AI to see if... No. Oh! That's a sniper rifle. That's not the gun that I thought it was. Uh, they've all bolted. <laughs> they've all bolted because they're worried about getting shot by me, which is actually a legit concern. Um, all right, I want to get rid of the police for a second. I know we're going to be potentially yeah, vulnerable um, okay, here, okay, I'll get you out of no but problem. if I can get rid of the police quickly...
Now, can they assault this building from anywhere else? That is the real question. I don't know if they can come from this side. Doesn't look like it, does it? I mean, I can actually hide even better. <laughs> oh no, we're doing tours of Los Santos homes. I try, I, I tried everything to get through that without starting this. I think maybe what might have caused me grief was the amount of vehicles. Just, it was the three white fugitives in a line, and we just couldn't shake it. Um, we did a good job getting past it once, but it, it was just too suspicious. Uh, actually, why have I got... Why not have the shotgun out? If a punter comes around a corner, they're gonna get shotgunned in the face. I feel like this is the best bet. Now, my 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 hope is that I, I'm not I'm not allowed to camp indefinitely. However, for example, here I run out and I probably die. They could, if they know where I am, they could park a car and jump the fe uh, jump the hedge. That would be bad news for me. That'd be a real bad news for me. Um. I would like to get out that way, although I don't know if I would, because that way you'd just end up being super exposed. Um, hugging this wall... There's so many sirens, but I'm presuming that's the hunters are still around. The blimp is in the air. There's a lot of police cars about, but they're not for me. We got rid- I mean, that's why I wanted to get rid of the police as quick as possible, is so that they couldn't follow the sirens to me. Uh, because the police would- so, and I don't want to get shot by the police at the end of the day, that would be a problem. Blimp's never going to see me in this alleyway. Someone could run around that corner, have a peek, and not see me. Although I would probably shoot them. I would probably be too quick to shoot them because it was- it's more of a threat, basically. Oh, uh, how do I get out of here? How do I get out of here without dying? Is really the conundrum. I'd like to get over the hedge. If I could get over that hedge. The sirens are dissipating. Which is good. Uh, I have something with a suppressor on, but... I'm, I'm being quiet because I'm trying to listen. For... The sirens are that side of the wall. I don't think I can climb that wall even if I wanted to. Um... Oh, God. Do we reckon Crane has seen us? I don't know how well they can see down there. There's way too many of them. Jeez. I don't know whether they... Because they, they're gonna be... Oh, bikes have turned up. They're gonna be... They've got to think that I'm in one of these houses, right? There's no way I can sneak out easily. Unless I can sneak over this wall, which I'm pretty sure is too high. Uh... Both ways are too high. That's annoying. I mean, I could I could go absolutely insano plan and boopy gun my way over, but that would leave me with a lot less health. Uh, could I boopy gun a prop into the? Could I boopy gun the umbrella into the corner and climb out that way? Though so they would hear it and see it. Is there any way I can wedge it? to clear that fence, that hedge. It really doesn't look like it, right? The police being around is a problem. I'm going to have to move at some point, right? So they're probably a little nervous about coming in to this area by virtue of I have significant firepower. Oh. Right. Plant. Next building. Oh, next building's no good. Well, Blakey may have may not have noticed getting shot, to be honest with you. I don't even know if we technically hit particularly well there. Uh, right, we are going for incognito. It's the fail race method. Move from bush to bush. Oh, get in the bush. Stay in the bush. I'm very no oh, god oh, asshole. Hide in a bush. You are a little bit... Actually, you're a bit more incognito in here than you were in the bloody buildings. Uh, I don't have an exit strategy, I'm not gonna lie. The good news of the bush plan is I can see better. <laughs> this is... 
<laughs> I've done many Survive the Hunts. This is currently the dumbest one I have ever done. I'm gonna get run over. I don't quite know what to do. I just feel like a lot of bullets is a good idea. But I don't know what the, how am I gonna how on earth am I ever getting out of here? I don't know. I don't have a plan. I have a machine gun. Oh, don't search bushes. Don't search bushes. Oh, okay, that's bad news. Okay, I think, I think it is time for a patented, if it moves, shoot it. <laughs> uh, right, new plan. How fast do you reckon this is? I have an idea, but I don't know whether this one here is going to work particularly well. I'm going to pretend to be an AI police car. Ow, oh, I've got the, the physics on this car are balked as anything. Uh, do we reckon they're going to suspect a police car bolting at high speed? How fast is the police car? The ambulance is following, but I don't think the ambulance is going to outrun us. Uh, so plus point of the siren is AIs will kind of get out of your way. Um, I think I've sown absolute chaos. I think the ambulance suspects... Oh, well, the ambulance clearly knows it's us, right? This thing dra drives absolutely garbage, but it is quite quick in a straight line. Oh, there's a pre somewhere over here. I don't know... Well, there it is. Uh, okay. Well, while we're here, be rude not to. Um... At this point, might as well explode that. It would have been funny if I'd blown up the ambulance, but I don't have time to deal with that for the moment. Okay, away we go! Panic and flee. Well, I don't even remember what the time was we set off at. It's quarter past 11, wasn't it? We've still got a while yet. Uh, we've blown up a few prees. Do I want to call cops off of us? Uh, no, maybe. Maybe. This thing is pretty good, actually. It's not, well, I say that. They've got, now they've got organised, they have got cars following us. So the reason why I was going in a straight line is I feel like this car had some pace, so I was trying to utilise the straight line speed over the ambulance. Uh, and you just minimise risks of having an accident, right? That was the hope. Uh, however, oh, okay, don't crash, don't crash, don't crash. It's a little bumpy through this section, but never mind. Uh, whoa. I mean, if I didn't have a wanted level, it'd be funny to park in the police station. Uh, with the car. I don't think they're still, I don't think they're behind us. I don't think they know where we are. Uh, I think we lost them in all of those. Now I can. Oh, I should probably have called Lester actually at this point. Ooh, whoop. Uh, because the thing that I don't want, I know where I'm going to go. I'm a little bit worried about a blimp. It's so difficult to know the blimp is still on us. Okay, that's the problem is I can't really see the blimp very easily. Uh, whoop. Uh, now, is there... They may be trying to cut me off from here. Oh! There's a pre there. Which I didn't actually know was there. But you know what? I will take it while I'm here. Uh, Alright, we will blow that one up. We got T-Bone from the Sylvia. I've forgotten what, one, what car... What it's called on the game. Whoop! Hello, ambulance. Don't mind me. Uh, right, more cars. You are cle clearly not looking. We've got another wanted level again. Oh, clonk, clonk, clonk. Uh-oh. Don't explode. Good landing. Go, 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 go. We did a little bit of a wheelie. We did do a wheelie in that one. 10 out of 10 stunt points for Fail Race Police Department. Don't give me ever, ever give me a police car. Uh, right, we are starting to get to emergency panic strategies. Emergency panic strategies normally involve going for a long swim. Uh, I don't want to go for a long swim, but they might involve going for a long swim somewhere. Uh, hello, Blakey. No, actually, you did slow me down. You gave us some grief uh, in running over of Blakey. Uh, well, I guess I found the thumbnail right there. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so I couldn't shake the blimp is the problem in all of that. Uh, oh, so the way to shake the blimp is to do lots of, like, U-turns, but that's not a good way to shake cars that are following you. Uh, because, well, funnily enough, you just run into them again. Uh, oh. 
Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Come on, come on, police car. This is a terrible getaway vehicle, I'm going to add. This is an absolute garbage getaway car. It just handles so badly. It's, it's really difficult and really uncooperative and gets so much airtime when it shouldn't. Uh, oh, well. Oh, that's... That I can't climb. Uh, that, that was a good hit. That hit kind of saved me. Duck, I think. Chris may have got run over. I think it was Chris in the Sylvia alike. Uh, and I think they were trying to shoot me after that punt, and I think they got ran over in the melee. Uh, I've got to ditch this car. It's way too floaty. It it got me out of the bush. That is that is what happened. I mean, I could maybe have taken out more of them in that scenario. However, it's such a gamble at that point. Um, yeah, okay, we've got Liam behind us. I mean, we're actually down to one behind us and a blimp. Oh, I just don't want floaty police car as the vehicle that's desperately, frantically trying to get away. Uh, do we just ditch it? That is the real question. Oh, okay, no, that's fine. That's fine. There's enough scenery to make a pit maneuver difficult down there. Liam has made a mistake. Liam has made a mistake. Uh, that's good. Where is Blimp? Blimp is directly out overhead. Can I... Uh, okay, I've got a plan. It's a dumbass plan, but it's a plan nevertheless. Uh, there are still too many cars behind us, even to do silly buggers. I was going to go to silly buggers in the canal, but there's way too many cars following us. And now airtime. Bad idea. Bad idea. Through this lot. Where is the blimp? Don't know. Can I break? I mean, I'm desperately trying to break glider. So I really don't want to have to ditch in the water, because that is quite dangerous as well. Oh, more cars. More cars. Bad. Car park saved me. Go, 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 go. Uh, this is the longest I've had just an awful car for pursuits in. Uh, we almost shook them. The problem is, like, you might say, well, why don't I just park up around a corner? The thing is, I don't know how many cars can see us. I can't always keep track of where the blimp is because it's high up and it takes time to look back, look up, try and find it. The time I don't have because I'm flat out in the city. Blimp is back above us. Blimp is less of my concern in some regards. Uh... Yeah, the blimp is slightly less of my concern uh, in that it can't really kill me. I just can't really do anything until it's gone. The cars are now all back in the line behind us. I mean, we've got so much time to go. We've actually got a good number of pre's so far, but we've got loads of time. Uh, I don't remember where the next pre is. Well, we know there's one in Mirror Park, and we know there's one at Lester's house. Well, do I try some sneaky buggers around it. I don't know the buildings well enough to try some sneaky buggers in, the in and around the buildings. Uh, now, they could... I don't think they're going to try and cut me off from this direction. Because, uh, see, even if I go for a ditch in the ocean, where do I go? There's a blimp on me. Uh, oh, a car with a big crash into a pillar there. Oh, that was one of them. Uh, okay, we've got... I think it's Liam's, the car behind us. We've got that thing. It's relatively quick. Um, I tell you what, if we hit a tram, it would be hilarious. But just would not be a fun way to die. Uh, oh, what the hell happened with that ballista? Go on, AI traffic car. Cause Liam to have an accident. You did not. Disappointing. Uh, we've lost a door at some point. Uh, right. Why am I doing... Oh, why did that happen? I'm not 100% sure what occurred and why it occurred, but it did. Uh, physics happened. I shouldn't have gone that way. Uh, oh, okay. Well, we are fine. We are fine. We are fine. We are less fine. But there is still a way out of this. Still a way out of this for us. Not a great way out of it, but we're still going. It might be emergency stratagem time. It might be time to go swimming, I think. We are severely running out of options. I've tried everything I can with this car. Oh, good hit. Land on your wheels again. We've landed it. We've punted a ruiner. We're still going. We're still moving. That's the last thing we needed to hit. Oh, duck. Duck and go. Duck and go. Well, I was trying to get to the water. Yeah, we've got to go. We've got to go for a swim. I've just got to get to the water safely here because this car is not cutting it. It's quick enough. In a straight line, it's quick enough. The problem is, is the physics are not built for bumps. Uh, now, how can I cut across and get to... Uh, I don't know how I can get to some water. Oh, oh no, that's a post. Oh, can't miss the turning. They have missed the turning down there. I could do with a little bit more leeway than we're getting. They've had a massive wreck on their own back there. I like the, si the sight of that. Uh, Blimp is following us into the tunnel. 
doesn't matter. It will see us leave the tunnel. Um, but that's irrelevant to me. I can't do anything about it anyway. So, yeah, we are going to go over this way. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And wiggle our way onto the beach. Now, we are going to have enough time to do what I want to do here. Because I think we're going for a jet ski. Uh, a jet ski plan is going to be over a jet ski number two on the stratagem. Uh, oh, God, car handles. Awful. It's so broken and the physics is so bad on it that, uh, yeah, it's not great. But I could have gone for a quad bike stratagem, to be honest with you. Uh, that might have actually been better, because a jet ski leaves me a little vulnerable in this. Oh! Go, dude! Go! Ah! Oh, it just didn't accelerate in time. Damn it! Damn it! It didn't get far enough away. I thought I had... If I hadn't crashed, I would have had enough time. If I hadn't crashed into the, into the pillar, I would have had enough time to do it. Uh, we just couldn't get far enough away. Yeah, the, p the problem, I should have ditched it. Maybe I should have, could have ditched it sooner. Uh, we almost did get away a couple of times. That was the, that was a difficult, that was a pro I say problem. But uh, that was a frustrating bit, is um, we could maybe have got away a little sooner. Um, we could maybe have got away a little sooner on that one. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's difficult. It's, it's, it's really difficult to know uh, on that. The police car, I mean, yeah, maybe rather than going for the police car, maybe what we should have done is gone for the uh, one of the hunter's cars. Um, I mean, that's a satisfying ending. It's a satisfying conclusion right there. Oh, uh, yeah, they did well. They did well. Uh, the police car, I'm amazed it survived. It shouldn't have survived as long as it did, but it did, which is always nice. Um, but yeah. Damn it. It was close. Oh, I say it was close. It was close-ish. We got a good number of cars destroyed. Uh, we got a good number of cars destroyed, but yeah. Not quite enough for us, unfortunately. But there we go. We did not survive the hunt. We did not escape from the city this time out. Uh, it was good fun. It was a good chase. It was an exciting chase. But, yeah. Should have... Well, yeah, there's, there's so many could have, should have... I thought I had a little bit more time than I did. Um, but what can you do? Uh, at the end, maybe we should have stood on the platform and machine gunned and dove off. But I'd already started... The problem is I'd started the animation already to get in the thing. So. Ah, well. That is going to be it for this for this video. Thank you all very much for watching, and until next time, a uh, goodbye.
Oh. <laughs> <laughs>